To the surprise of no one, Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League is a failure. So Warner Brothers Discovery has said that the game has fallen short of their expectations. So following a number of delays, the game was finally released on February 2nd to mixed reviews at best. It was widely considered a terrible game across the board. And now the chief financial officer provided a brief update on the game's early performance during a Warner Brothers Discovery's first quarter earning call on Friday. And he went on to say that this year, Suicide Squad, one of our key video game releases in 2024, has fallen short of our expectations since its release earlier in the quarter, setting our game's business up for a tough year over the year one comp of Q1. And having a quick look on Steam, we can see that as of four minutes ago, there was a total of 770 players with a 24 hour peak of 863 players. Now, of course, this is just on Steam, but these numbers are really painting a bad picture for this bad game.